For this problem, we want to use transformations in the graph of f of x equals x squared to graph g of x equals negative x squared plus 4. g of x is equal to negative f of x plus 4. The negative function means that we will reflect the graph over the x-axis. So our new points are now at negative 1, negative 1, and 2, negative 4. Connecting the points, we get the graph of negative f of x. Adding 4 to the function means that we will shift our new graph up by 4 units. So our new points are now at 2, 0, and negative 1, 3. Connecting the points, we get the graph of g of x. And this is the final answer.